rerouting ports. Oh, well, it shouldn't. It shouldn't oh, do. Alright. Let's see if this works. Lose. Make sure that this is working though. All right, welcome back. Thank you. This game has cursed me. Oh shit, why? Why was I so close? Oh shit, can't fight that, can't fight that. I'm on fire! Shit. See, people are typing. You guys, give me a second. Why would a witch kill kings? I'm a witcher no more. That was long ago. So you're a hired thug now. No, fuck. All right, I think I got my groove. I think I got the groove. I'm not gonna make it through this one, I don't think, but. I, I got my groove. I got my groove. I got my groove. Oh, Jesus. Why am I going down the rabbit hole now? Why do you have. They think I killed Foltec. You fought for playing Soldier Boy. Soldier Boy! I need to disengage quicker than that. Two hits and then I have to nope out. One. Oh shit. One. Two. I missed the second. 
Oh, shitballs. Oh, no, 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 no. No, come on! One, two. No, nope the fuck out, nope the fuck out. Nope, dude. It's too far away for that. God damn it, that was not good. When he shields, I can parry? Wait, I can parry a shield? Altus, we're doing Altus. I want to do Altus. Por favor. Okay. Why do you have they think I killed Voltex. It's your own fault for playing soldier boy. Shit! No, don't go for the third. Jesus Christ. Shit. time. Why is he- oh my god, it's so hard to disengage. So hard to disengage. Yes, kitty, I did. If you were on Discord, you would know. Shit. I know I'm panicking. One, two, roll away. Fuck you. Oh, bitch. That was stupid, that was stupid, that was stupid. One, two, roll away. Fucking hell! Shit. I'm not doing well with this. I hate this game. <laughs> ah! 
There is no bots. Only the wolf. Why do you hound me? They think I killed Voltec. Oh, yes, come on. No, 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 no. You cannot parry that. Oh, shit. Fuck. Shit. Okay, so Ard, or whatever, the, the one that's the, the air or whatever the fuck. This one. You have to hit him twice to take that shield down. Fucking hell. Okay, that's what the interweb said. One. Two. Shield down. Shield is not down. I have been lied to. <laughs> oh my god, this fight is ass. You want me to swap between spells while doing this fight? You are crazy. Why do you hound me? They think I killed Voltec. It's your own fault for playing. It did not remove the thing. He stepped over it. You said you're in. Also, like, there's no time to set this shit up, man. Now when he's fucking attacking me like that, like, it's... Uh-uh. I don't get anywhere with that. <laughs> Why do you hound me? They think I killed Voltec. I think this is the best fight I've got, or chance I've got, is just... Go in, stun his ass. <sighs> nope, I'm done. I'm done. Let's go play Armo. I can't do this. I can't do this. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Ah, oh. fuck this game. Just go to a different load. Letho can kiss my ass. He can suck my hairy balls. I don't even know if he's got him. I don't know, but he can do that. But seriously, this guy's a piece of shit. I'm gonna get some daggers and poke him from a distance. Took a wrong turn.
to fucking kill this asshole. We're gonna string him up by his toes. Slather him in honey and stick him outside and watch the ants eat him alive. Or tie him up so that the birds can peck at him. Piece of shit. Who the fuck has daggers? We're gonna go get some daggers. We're gonna just throw it at him from a distance. Is it a, is it a dagger that returns, or do I need like a shit ton of daggers to stab into his ass? Do some rusty well balanced daggers give his ass tetanus. Going to assume we're going to need more than one, but we're going to find out. I have purchased a dagger. We're going to excuse ourselves outside and go find some dozer to throw it at. Why did you take your boots off? Oh my god, we're doing this shit again. Okay, so it goes over here. So I'm gonna need more than one. Go back out, put the sword away. Put that one away too. Jesus Christ. Okay. So I we'll have to go purchase, purchase more daggers because I have a feeling I'm going to be tossing a crap ton of daggers at this asshole. That's five. You know, we'll just we'll just get these two because I have a feeling that we're gonna be going through those too. I don't know how many daggers this guy's gonna eat, but. Why do you keep taking your boots off? Why do you keep taking your boots off? Where do I put you? I, I'm sitting here pushing this button. Why do you use your boots always? It's either the boots or the pants. My frustration. I've got ten daggers. I don't even think ten daggers is going to be enough for this asshole. I don't know if I have any that's in storage. Like 
Nah. He's got nothing. What about food? Do you have food that like helps me or no? I don't even think so. No, just a bunch of crap. Okay. If ten daggers doesn't work on big boy, I don't know what to say. I'm gonna be honest. Big boy looks like he's gonna take like a fucking crate full of daggers just to take his ass down. Fucking roided out piece of shit. I'm gonna kill the king because why the fuck not? Yeah, that sounds like a great fucking pastime. I don't know, we're gonna find out. All I know is this guy can seriously eat a big fat dick. Chess is angry. Not exactly angry, I'm more like fucking annoyed. I don't even know what these things do. Where is well, my boy? To craft some things, see what he's got for options. Hmm. Usually he's out here playing in the weeds. I guess he abandoned my ass too. All right. I'm not going to last by the time I get there, but you know, hey. This one might. Put your pants back on. Put your pants on! What the shit? Oh my god. Oh, for fuck's sake.
Yes. Why are you doing this? We need a room. Make sure you don't betray our room. So we went Joke. through this. Who I'm so I I'll discover you Who are you? Oh my god. I am Kira Demo we No. We fought this wouldn't be said it. Oh I don't Sir King. Ah, fuck you, Enough of this farce. Bedry, Enray! Die! Such a pity we're on opposite sides. Why do you hell? They think I killed Volta. It's your own fault for being a soldier boy. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Oh my god, I don't know how to use daggers in this. Daggers do nothing. <laughs> Oh my god. This game pisses me off so much. Why do you have It's your own fault for playing soldier boy. Oh my god. Actually daggers do stuff. Apparently I don't know how to throw daggers, but hey. was that? Oh, what the shit was that? Oh my god, now I can't use... Why is there such a delay on that? Okay, okay, I figured it out. I think. 
Tigers, there's a pause, there's a hesitation. But they do damage, so... Why you hound me? They think I killed Foltec. It's your own fault for playing soldier boy. Oh my god. What the fuck do people expect you to fucking dagger this guy? You can't, you can't, I can't do this. I keep missing. Whoever designed this game should be ashamed of themselves. This is like the most sloppy convoluted fight I've ever had to deal with. Why do you hound me? Daggers don't break through the shields. By the time that it takes you to set that shit up to focus it, he's he's already moved. Like what the flying fuck? This this is a laughing stock. Jesus fucking Christ. So those people who apparently were able to get this to work with daggers, props to you. No, you have you does not auto aim. You have to aim it. So wherever you're looking at, that's where your, the reticle is, and you have to move it. But since it goes into slow motion, I don't know if it's a controller error on that, but like the feedback, it's clunky, if that makes any sense. You either barely tap it, and it doesn't move, or you move it, and it's like, woo! So I'm not quite sure what the problem is with, is with that. But the dagger thing, it's that's disgusting. Why do you hound me? They think I killed Foltec. It's your own fault for playing so long.
You're giving me a second, Lisa. No, there's there's no snap that's the thing it's why do you hound me they think I right so then you have to move it up but by the time that you get that done like he's already closed the gap he's like right on top of you he's gonna fucking do everything that he can It doesn't feel good. It doesn't feel like what other games have presented, I guess. It's slow. It doesn't feel good. Also, something about this fight is that if he knocks you down, you barely have time to get up before the bomb that he tosses at you or grenade or whatever actually hits you. So basically, if you get hit once by him, you get pushed down and that's game over. Like you, there's, you can't get back up without getting hit twice in a row, basically. I'm not quite sure what what is going on with this, but... <laughs> we'll put it to easy and see if that works. They think I killed Voltec. your own fault for playing soldier boy. Ah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Really easy is actually gonna make the difference on this. Apparently with easy mode you can do this shit. That's fine with me. I don't give a crap. Fuck. I didn't want to do it, but... A witcher and a few elves are enough to kill a king? You've no idea how many people were eager to help us. You really think they will all keep quiet? Your best time is running out. 
The others will be judged and condemned for sowing chaos. So, why? You were one of us, Geralt. You saved us. Now we're even. But... Your witch is good with magic. Think she'll be able to teleport me to Eden. If she behaves, I won't harm her. I'll find you. See you in Eder and then. Asshole. I know. I just wanted to get through the story because I really want to know what happens, but Jesus fucking Christ. Where's Roach? Ah! We killed a few of his men. The rest ran. Is Leto dead? On his way to Flotsam. How do you know? He's he wanted to find Triss. Kill him. Before he contacts the others. You shouldn't have trusted a Dwan. Let's go. We can't go there, Geralt. The garrison. Of course. I forgot what kind of warriors you are. <laughs> Nest Ted at Gwynblade. Good luck. Grr. Yeah, 60 time was last time, by the way. Ah. <sighs> Now I'm just angry and I feel gross. Okay. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> no, I'm not going to reload. <laughs> um, options, gameplay, go back to normal. Also, how's it going, squirrel? So if you watch Watch, watch the the reticle. It it moves, right? Like so, that's on like a, a thing that's closer. I mean, it'll show you. It changes like that. I like, but it's you either do that, tap it a little bit. Nothing really moves. But if you do anything, it's like I don't like it. It feels. It doesn't feel smooth. It doesn't feel good. Can I do an S movement? That was my attempt. It's, it's, it's clunky. <laughs> no, it just... I understand that this game is a, a little bit on the older side, but I mean, I really do feel like games, even back then, they didn't feel that bad. I just, mm. I mean, go out, get some dinner or a fancy lunch or something. You'll be fine. I mean, it's a little late for lunch, but... I miss... Oh! Roach has my sword. <gasps> oh, that's not good. That's horrible. I'm sorry.
That music is telling me something that I'm not comfortable with. I could go for a nice cold rum and coke with tequila and coke. We need some coke. We need some Coca-Cola, get some booze, mix together. Shit. Huh. It's early enough. A storm approaches. Be wary, Witcher. Oh. There's a slaughtering. Oh, fuck. Oh. We were too good to you. Fattened yourselves on our toil. Uprising. Who was it that slaughtered our lads in the forest? Stinking non-humans. Be gone, shitty fiddler. Or we'll slit your throat too. We didn't kill this. Geralt! And now, good people, return to your homes before you... So what'll it be, innkeeper? They killed my son. Damned elves. I want their blood for that. These elves had nothing to do with your son's death. Don't shed their blood. Yeah. Now that you mention it, yeah, leave them be. Go home, folks. The fuck, man, I might Thank drink you, that shit. We'd be dead if not for you. The sooner we flee, the better. Take care. Who opened the gates of hell? I don't have any proof, but my coin's on Lorito. Rulers are always looking for a way to cover their mistakes and failures. Yeah. And the mob always loves a circus. Yep. This town will never be the same. A time of disdain has come. Time to leave. How did the rioting start? They say it's revenge for those soldiers who died following Roach. But they were just thugs on Lorito's pay. Almost no one misses them. Spontaneous riot my ass. Lorito staying out of it, keeping his hands clean. But his thugs are inciting the mob. I've seen several soldiers in civilian garb leading it. But you won't find any proof against the Commandant. I don't intend to. Okay. Why don't the guards do anything? Why would they? The squirrels slaughtered their cronies, and Lorito hasn't given them any order. We need to find Triss. Last I saw her, she was on her way to meet Sheila in her rented quarters at the inn. I told Triss about the megascope Zoltan's been building. Let's go. There's no time to lose. 
I was lucky enough to get the key to Sheila's nest. Incidentally, for a big woman, the innkeeper's wife is surprisingly nimble. Come on! What did you do? You got to lead the way, bro. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, what an asshole. What are we doing now? It's that sorcerer. Leave them alone. They've done you no harm. Right, they're our neighbors. Let's go home, lad. Jesus Christ. I just about felt the blades chill between my ribs. You've done them no harm. Why are they so? Mobs always need a scapegoat. That sucks. Okay. Blood. Not a bad thing for those boots. Blood. Blood for the blood gods. Oh, that's not good. Not good. There has been an incident. Don't just stand there. We need to look for clues. I don't fucking stand here if I want to keep it here. Alright. Let's start over here. Stupid. That's not what's happened, you dumb shit. God. What a mess. Somebody had a good time in here. Trashed everything. I don't get it. Someone else had to be here. You don't say! Oh my god, you are amazing at this, you... The brothel's behind that wall. Maybe the madam saw what happened. Let's go. It's true what they say. Bodies like an axe. Come back later. We're closed. They've killed one of my girls. It's Deride, Geralt. That was her room. What happened? They murdered her. Yesterday, they loved her, drank wine with her, told her she's pretty. Today, five of them came, drunk on blood, screaming filth. Did she have a client at the time? No, she was with me. What are you looking at? I was consoling her. I was hoping you knew what happened in the next room. I noticed a peephole. But if you were busy... We were. Until we heard voices beyond the wall. Schiller normally cast spells that blocked both sight and sound. But there was nothing like that this time. We started peeping. Me first. I saw that redhead, Triss Merigold, and Cedric, our drunkard ex-squirrel. The redhead approached the magic mirror and said, Let's see who our Ice Queen's been talking to recently. She meant Sheila. Even I figured that out. She waved her hand, shouted an incantation, and a man appeared in the room, mighty ugly. Darai was so scared, she squealed. When I finally got Darai out of the way, a different figure was in the room, a woman Triss called Philippa. Greetings, Philippa. Those look like dildos. <laughs> Triss, you're looking nice.
Oh. Why are you Kay. using Sheila's megascope? I can't believe she approved it. That's like using her toothbrush. Sheila's oblivious to it. Do you think the girl... Saskia the Dragon Slayer? Legend has it she killed a dragon. No, is that why she's called a Dragon Slayer? It won't be easy, but she's already accomplished miracles. So war is inevitable. Hensult can't be reasoned with. Why did Sheila come to Flotsam? It's a delicate matter. We need someone at Hensult's court, but he hates sorceresses. I know. Hensult's only son died in a hunting accident three years ago. The king has failed to sire more offspring, in spite of trying incessantly. She claims she can heal the king's faulty apparatus, but needs very rare ingredients. Which she intends to harvest from the Kaelin. Exactly. This way a sorceress will have the king's ear again. Okay. That's all I know, really. Where's Philippa? Dandelion. Any idea who Philippa is? Philippa Eilhart. Sorceress counselor to King Radovid of Redain. Oh. A grand mistress of the world's most fetid cuisine. Politics. Ew. She's amoral in a crystalline way. So devoid of conscience that she's a phenomenon. Rumor is she's out of favor at the Redanian court. Which, if true, she probably arranged herself in order to leave the capital. What happened to Triss? I don't know. I already told you about the only conversation I heard. Just before those murderers came. They kicked me and stabbed her eye. But I heard fighting from the other room. The sorceress was screaming. When the murderers left, searching for other victims, I peered outside. Thought I saw Cedric sneaking through the alleys towards the forest. He was staggering. Thank you, Margo. I owe you. Witcher, wait. Give this to Yarveth. A letter? The names of Darai's killers. You'll understand. You're spying for Yorbeth? You're spying for Yorbeth? I help him from time to time. Just give him the letter. I'll try, but I can't promise anything. I wait here for me. I'm going to find Cedric. Do I want to find Cedric? I just need to follow him. I don't think I want to go. I will go, we'll go. Follow me in the blood trail, the blood trail, the blood trail. Follow me in the blood trail. I lost it already. <laughs> oh, drinking some cap. Drink a cat potion. Okay, uh. Gato de siempre. Fucking littering. I guess this is it. Although this looks like fire, but you know. I can't tell because everything is a different color right now.
Head mill, Windblade. I no longer feel the pain. I've always wanted to die among trees. Uh. Cedric, what happened? Triss asked me for help. I killed the Dwan guarding the door, and we broke in. Again, I killed a Dwan. I know. Where's Triss? A Witcher came in, attacked us. I tried to protect Triss. He was fast. It's another Witcher that we have to deal with? He hit Triss before she. Not Laredo or Laredo or a big boy? He knew how to fight a sorceress. Then he ordered her to activate the Megascope. Oh no. He needed to get to Edern, near the dwarven town of Bergen. Triss said it was madness. But she didn't have the coordinates. He gave her a strange look. Threatening. Oh. Better give it your best. You're going first. With me right behind well. you. <laughs> but then I passed out. When I woke, they were gone. I knew I was dying. The forest called me. Why, Cedric? Why did you get involved? Why did you? Sometimes we must. Have I told you about my visions? That's why I drink. It helps. I'm safe in a mist of vodka. See nothing, feel nothing. Cedric, calm down. But now I see clearly. You need to regain your memory. Only then will you... No shit, I've been trying to in the past game and a half. And why? How can I get it back? In Edo. In a place tainted with dark magic. Dark magic! Where ghosts of the fallen will fight a great battle. Oh boy. Save their souls. And your memory will return. Gotta save some ghosts. Alright. You're dying. Ah, uh, the bunny and some deer and the burb. They come to bid you farewell. My forest. Raphael. Windblade. Farewell. Now you shall become food for the mushrooms. Look, you've already got some going on. Mushroom food. Mmm, shrimps. Nice portobello. Geralt, where have you been? The king slept. Playing in the woods. Had him. He fled. Teleported to Edern. What? How? He forced Triss to cast his spell. Shit. Roach sent me to find you. We're setting off. He's learned something new. Okay. So you tell are also up to something big. Okay. What are the Scoia'tael planning? They want to storm the barge and they need your help. When did you join the Scoia'tael's Open? It's not like that. They're taking the prisoners to Drakenburg. A special prison for non-humans. Bloody... They're taking the hobbits to Isengard. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I couldn't resist. I could not resist. What's Roach planning? He went off on Laredo, so it must concern the Commandant. It's something important. I'll talk to them. Maybe Roach of the Scoia'tael can finally be useful. That's pretty much all I can do here. So, yeah. Wait, can I loot the bodies? No, you're about this over here. We're gonna go yap to him first. Am 
I got the song in my head. You're taking the hobbits to Isengard. If you know, you know. Ten hour fucking repeat. Yorvis awaits you, to one. What, you jealous? You want some of this? Huh? You want some of this? Huh? 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 Am I too much for you? Am I too much for you? Huh? 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 Alright. Be sure to speak to your vet, Geralt. Where is he? He forced Triss to teleport them both to Edern. No! The yes! The will pay for my stupidity with their lives. Elias, ready the unit to march. You'll leave immediately. There was a massacre in Flotsam. The streets run red with your brethren's blood. I know. That's why I need your help. You want me to murder humans at your side? I wish death upon every one of those Dwan. But that's not the point. Upper Edern is our goal. Okay, what's so important there? Why Upper Edern? The Pontar Valley is a juicy piece of meat beset by hounds. The Scoia'tael bite hardest. It's our land. Our forefathers' land. I'm no bandit, Gwynblade. I lead a great army. Okay. What do you know about Vergen? You you're going to Vergen. True. Why go to a dwarven town? Henselt and his army have pitched camp on the right riverbank. The Virgin and a sorceress gather reinforcements to defend Edern. Which sorceress? Philippa Eilhart. What's a Redanian sorceress doing in Edern? Only she can reveal that. Okay. And you plan to be king? King Yorbeth I? I've already told you. I know the head the crown would fit. We merely have to place it there. Whose head is it? One who believes in integrity, honesty, and honor. A person who won't sell out to Nilfgaard for a few florins. A woman named Saskia. Is she your fiance? Don't mock me, Gwynblade. <laughs> it sounds like she's more important to you, not just a woman whose head would fit the crown. You'll understand once you meet her. Soon the whole world will hear of the Virgin of Edern, a woman blessed with extraordinary courage. Has she proven her courage, or is that just talk? She defeated a dragon. That's just, um, that's, nobody knows for sure from what I understand. What the Sounds fuck? Like you want to establish an elven state. There is already an elven state. Dolblathana. Francesca Findabare rules there. Rules? She merely carries out Nilfgaardian orders. We want a truly free state, where an elf could visit a human inn. A land where humans could enter the forest without fear. I'm for this. I'm for this. I am so for this. What does the leader of an army expect of me? That you accompany me to Edern. Perhaps you'll find your sorceress there. You'll certainly find someone who will soon change the balance of power in the north. That's two days travel on foot. You'll never make it in time. I have a plan. What plan? First, you must agree to help us. I need to know more before I decide. No, Vatgun. You helped me with Letha. That's the sole reason we're speaking. We may both be pursuing the same son of a bitch, but I haven't forgotten the company you arrived in. Make your choice now. I'll let you go if you refuse. I couldn't do that later. I can help, but I need to take- Be quick. I wanna go see what Roach is talking about first. Yorvis awaits you, Duan. Duan! Sound a little jealous there, buddy. Oh, Cedric is dead. 
So that sucks. Put my sword back. Rudge took it. God damn it. No! Wait, who has- No! He's got it! Yorveth has- I'm gonna have to stick with Yorveth. He's got my sword. Take care of yourself. These two are probably fighting for the same bullshit, by the way. And if that comes down to that, I'm going to stick with Yorveth because he's got my sword. Hello, Geralt. Vernon's waiting inside. Okay. Roach, things have gotten a little more complicated. What the fuck were you doing with the Scoia'tael? You gave Yorveth a sword. You followed me? I've got others who do that for me, Geralt. Vess, to be exact. Yorveth knows a lot about the Kingslayer, and they no longer see eye to eye. He could lead us to him. The only journey I'll make with your Beth in tow is to the scaffold in Vizima's marketplace. Okay, Kingsley you need to... And Edern, Jesus Christ. ...and force Triss to teleport them both. Damn, he's made a mockery of us. If that's how he wants to play, I'll make him regret it. Flotsam's ablaze. How did it start? When Vess reported you'd met with your Beth, I ordered Lurido to provide us with backup. The incompetent oafs were supposed to wait for a signal. But the crossbowmen were twitchy. We surprised them, but Yorveth, the Scoia'tael, gave us hell. We barely escaped alive. Many of my men are wounded, but Lurido's people... When news that elves massacred a dozen soldiers hit the trading post, two of the soldiers' fathers decided to take it out on an elven girl. <sighs> what happened next. I heard you have news for me. Lurido has a deal with Kedwin. That merchant living in his house is Hensel's agent. For a pouch of gold, the good commandant promised to support Kedwini troops in the event of a conflict. So what now? Don't I'm just Lurido. To squeeze him for information. And I've sentenced Commandant Lurido to death. Roach, we have to sail. We need to get Fuck. to I'm not leaving until I deal with Lurido. The spy may know something about the Kingslayers. I wouldn't be surprised if Hensel to Kedwin was behind all this. Damn it, Geralt, it's not a date. You can't keep putting it off. <sighs> I am horrible at making decisions like this. I'm going to go work with the Scoia'tael on this one. Because, we, okay, so from my mindset of what I'm seeing thus far, I think Roach has things under control. He's... This fight doesn't seem to be as, as valiant as this one. Because <clears throat> Yorveth is wanting to fight for a place 
that everybody can like what he t what he was selling to me sounded amazing where humans can go out into the forest without any worry and that elves can go into an inn without worry like that's that is yes like <laughs> he's fighting for that but with roach like he's he's got his own he's got his own things I feel like Roach can deal with with this. Vernon's waiting inside. Apparently I'm gonna I'm gonna hurt the relations on that, but <sighs> Blossom's got a garrison. We don't need a witcher. What really sucks is that this is going to really put a dampening thing on the relation that I have with Roach because he took a risk. Mm. Ro uh, because he took a risk. He, he let me out. He followed me. He let me do stuff. You know, things like that. So I feel indebted to him, so maybe at a later point, maybe I can go back with that. But as of right now, Yorveth has the better deal, in my opinion. Ooh. Nice. Okay. So yeah, now we're gonna go with Yorveth. <sighs> Yorveth awaits you. Do what? Yeah, let's let's do this. Have you considered? Count me in. excellent. We, we need to capture the prison barge. You want to enter a town where they're massacring elves? I take back what I said. You're not grandiose. You're mad. <laughs> My mother, likewise. Don't disappoint me. Got it. Okay. I really hope that this does not come to bite me in the ass. Enter the town. We'll divide the unit. Take my best scout and attack from the heart. <sighs> I'll sail down river with the others. Most of the guards should be at the trading post. So we're benefiting from the massacre? Not the way I'd put it, but yes. Right. The harbor could still be dangerous. What did you expect? A tea party? Yeah. It's not that. We should trick them as we did Letho. We can't expect any support in the oh, harbor. Man. But most of the guards are at the trading post. There's only a handful to deal with on the barge. Fine. They'll be dead before they can reach for their swords. Then we can signal the others. None will get away this time. All right, let's do it your way. Skoyatal, Evelyan! Vryad! Vryad! Follow me!
I think Yerveth is leading me. I'm not leading him. What the fuck? I see you, kitty. This is the place. We have to get past the gate. Piece of Lembert. What? Nothing, Duong. Lead. I know. Oh my god. Jesus. Halt! Who goes there? The Witcher. I captured an elf. Soon catch. That's Yorvith. Garrido will piss himself with joy. He ordered me to take him to the barge. Ha! We're about to sink that heap. Right here? What? And foul the water? No. We'll drown them down river. Let's go. Jesus. Yorvith's been caught. Close the gates tight. I don't want a flea slipping through. Oh, by the way, this is for you, Kitty, because of what we talked about earlier. Here you go. Ooh. Now that you see the power you helped to create, what do you make of it? I see a name for the first time as well. Yet I sense nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I suppose not. They wish to watch. Uh. side of the coin a concept devised by philosophers in Oxenford who have never set foot into Flotsam or any place like it no one's going to die today Yorvith apart from the commandant's paid lackey yeah nope nope she and I had an agreement on something so that was that was the exchange Oi, where are you taking that elf it's Yorvith Lorita ordered me to put him on the prison barge fuck me Yorvith himself the son of a bitch shot me brother. Mind if I settle a score a little? Stand aside. There's no time for that. Why? <laughs> I have orders to take him to the barge. <laughs> Who are you then? An elf lover? Oh my god. You don't have to follow Levito's orders, but think what'll happen if you don't. Hmm. Interesting. Guess we'll have to see. <clears throat> That's for my brother, elven bastard. Damn. I tried. See that little Duan whore? I like his kind best. Killing them is like pulling weeds. Strangely relaxing. They might have gotten suspicious if you resisted longer. Think so? I just wanted a little diversion. I think you're <laughs> really nice to have on the barge. I know. And where might you be going? I'm taking Yorvith to the barge. Lorito's orders. Oh. All right then. Like we're playing with fire here. <laughs> I'm a mod's getting intense. Yeah. Hey, Vic, since you're here, check to go get like. A drink run so that we can mix some some bubbly with it. It is V Day after all, you know. Take those on the left. You go right. Did we? 
remember him talking about it. Oh, I do not. <laughs> Speaking of Akita, This guy does not catch fire. There you go. Sail. Our women are prepared to die. But we have the liquor. We need the stuff to mix with it. But I'm not prepared to let murder happen. I'm going ashore. <laughs> Bloody Dwan. <laughs> I got my sword back. Save the elven women, Witcher. Commandant will read your command. Oh, shit! Rolling, rolling, rolling. Yes, I am lacking the soda. Where's Lorita? He's escaped. Gwynblade! 
Laredo's calling for reinforcements. We must sail. The tower's on fire. We have to jump. Come on, you guys. I'm on fire. Oh shit, there's a Terry! <laughs> Have a good one, Terry. Yeah, no, it's because I haven't started the fight. I'm sorry. Oh shit, I burned alive. Oops. <laughs> we work on that again. Ah, sh oh, the dead guy's down here. <laughs> oh, shit, they come down. <laughs> oh god! Don't be gullible. And then that's Terry. I'll go, Liman. I don't know. Let's just go. One at a time, one at a time. Everybody wants some kisses here. Oh, you dead like one. I don't know. That didn't make any fucking sense. I mean, they're, they're screaming, they're burning alive. I don't know, I do. Anyway. This tower is on fire. <laughs> Where's Lorito? He's escaped. Quinblade! Lorito's calling for reinforcements! We must sail! The tower's on fire. Okay, what's one? Unbind us. There's two. The fire is progressing! All of a sudden, boy, what was that? If the local folk don't hunt him down, someone else will. It's meaningless. You rescued our women. We are indebted. Help me find the Kingslayer and Triss. Will be you. Yeah. In that case, Tavergan, prepare to set sail. Did Vernon Roach 
Coach sail out of here all right? He's fine, if that's what you ask. We met and chatted. Imagine that. I wanted him to know that he was only leaving because I let him uh, do so. Okay. Did you kill him? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh! Sumerian Special Forces, created by Foltest to combat the Scoyatal after the first war with Nilfgaard. Veterans, professionals, the best of the best. This is the end, Roach. See these emblems? Tamerian lilies, that's all I lacked. I've defeated the commanders of all the Special Forces in the North. Now I shall unite the Scoyatal. Finish what you started. I shan't kill you, Roach. We Enshe never kill the last specimens of dying breed. Live on and remember who defeated you. Remember he can do so again. That failed, Vernon Roach. You're making a mistake, Yorveth. I will find you. Okay, that was awkward. Did not expect that. Yeah, we chatted. Yeah, I almost murdered the dude. <laughs> we made it. This is just the beginning. But you chose the right side, and I'm pleased. Did I? <laughs> After that, I just saw. I don't know, man. day. Very true. He kidnapped Triss Marigold. It seemed like Fulta's flight had not been enough. It seemed like the killer also wanted the monarch's former advisor. There was no time to think. It was time to act. Grabbing Geralt, I embarked on a voyage upriver, deeper into the Pontar Valley. If the elves could be believed, it was there that free folk from all around had assembled beneath Bergen's banners to resist the the exceptional individuals who made up my fellowship for this important quest. I usually get nervous around Scoyatel. I see them as murderers and find their presence outright unwanted. But I must admit I was glad to have the help of Yorveth and his infamous Bunch, who could prove highly helpful. Help, helpful. That's not nice. Highly useful then. Okay. Cha that was chapter one. Woo! Chapter two. Here we go. Three thousand men burned to ashes in Minas. I remember the stillness when the news reached Vengerberg. The palace, the streets, the houses, the entire capital cloaked in silence. The cry was here, every last man. I was somewhere beyond that hill, in the middle of the massacre. What is your intention, Sassy? I intend to stop Eden from being stunned. We can't kill the war with Hensoft. We must parley. Leave issues of war to me. Don't look like Concentrate on King Hensoft. The Arthur Hedrin claims he's short-tempered. Provoke him to strike and... Some of these names. Hensoft's Yorpin. Spit on the nobles, prince. They've meant nothing since the day my peasant force scattered them on the Dithni. By the good day the creed, my lord. The girl is a demon incarnate. Firstly, the girl has a name. Secondly, she's the best commander I have. All others have betrayed me. She's a monster. The creed spoke to me in a dream. I saw a snake-like she. If 
Cat enabled. Hello, damn it. Salutations. Okay. We shall sign everything, your grace. As you. We have guests. Welcome, Stennis, son of Damabend. I invite you to politeness. Greetings, Henself. You seem at home in Adern. You are here, yet I do not recall inviting you. Oh, sure. Ferrot did so in your stead. I'm here at his behest. I've broken no truces or treaties yet. Yet. Oh, is that so? Mr. Brogan, please escort Count Fellot to a secluded spot and remove his troublesome head. Don't you dare, boy. You're no king. Your father. My father is dead. The folk still mourn him while you betray his good name and his country. Your Majesty, I must request your protection. This young man has lost his mind. Take him away. Your Majesty, what of our agreement? I need you no longer, Ferret, now Stennis is here. Anyone else wish to object? Wonderful. To the matter at hand, then. Well said. This guy looks like I a dick, by the life. way. Both of them. 200 armed men in camp nearby. Enough to hold the fort for several hours. Another 5,000 battle-hungry lads await on the other bank. What say you to that? There'll be 5,000 dead lads should you move against Bergen. Yeah. Take time to consider, boy. These are bought to marches and be a piece of land. Relinquish it to me and you'll keep your crown. Oppose me and I shall crush you. Crush me. Give me Crush me. And return to Vengerberg. This piece of land generates more revenue annually than all the forests of the great Kedwin combined. Upper Edern is an everlasting pot of gold. Should I simply relinquish it? Or do you plan to make a purchase? Will you pay me with berries? With animal pelts? Will you send your armies into Kedwin's woods to gather mushrooms? You're right. Better I send them to steal your pot of gold. I'll not be intimidated, Hensort. Perhaps. Is it possible you merely play the courageous cockerel, yet deep inside fear eats at your heart? You want to try Does me? one push enough to send you over the edge? Or must I push twice? Try me. Yeah. I'm tired of this discussion. I have the upper hand, and no amount of scintillating talk will change that. We both know I'll not leave empty-handed. What do you propose? Get on your knees and beg. That's what I propose. Get on your fucking knees and beg. Withdraw your forces across the Pontar, and for all time, relinquish any claims to Upper Eden. Whoa, hold there! I don't believe you understood my query. What will I get out of it? Your life. You mock me? You think this is a game? Yes. You just talked yourself into a war, you little shit. Bring don't it. threaten me. We came here to speak. Yeah. Enough of your prattle. Draw your sword. Saskia. I'm ready. Care to dance, your majesty? <laughs> Killed him. Stop. Stop in the name of Creed, Freyr, and Militele. What the shit? Oh, you're a bad man. Okay.
Oh, so what kind of fucking belt is that? Oh, you pushed a button somewhere with that guy's face. You fucked up, eh, Aaron? The milk of Mother Creatrix's tits, Geralt of Rivia, and are the best company to boot. Yarpin Zigrin. Yarpin. <laughs> okay. It's been years, you old prick. It's great to see you in good health. Geralt, staring as if you've seen a ghost. Muster up a hug for an old friend. Geralt's head's not exactly on straight. Ha! Meaning he truly did in, Foltis. Fine by me. Foltis was a plowing niggard and a niggardly plower. You did right, Geralt. Not the point. Geralt's lost his memory. And I didn't kill Foltis. Right, right. What's the difference? Someone did. But we're bigger problems now. Where's Saskia? Oh, I. Why is this butcher here? We're all butchers I've come with a hundred archers, the best in the world. We're here to aid your cause. Well, you'll need to wait. Saskia and Prince Penis, uh, uh, rather, Skinnis, went off to parley with Hensel. Me and the boys are waiting in case something goes wrong. I think something went wrong. Sun's gone dark. Call the sorceress. Come, Geralt. Something, something went boop. That sorceress. Oh, I do believe we summoned something. Something is whispering sweet nothing to me in this game. And it sounds awfully sweet.
the shit's going on? The fuck was that owl? Ooh, we got owl bombs. Owl bombs. Okay, Zappy Owl. Can't get ahead of the owl, got it. I don't know what that was about, but okay. God, this owl's on our side. This is trippy. This is fucking trippy.
Well, you definitely want to destroy the wraiths in this, apparently. The faster you get them down. The faster that goes away. Good one, Naiso. The lady we saw. Flying through fog. Saskia, are you all right? It's just a flesh wound. You and the Witcher, we owe you our lives. I'm here to protect you. And you, Witcher? I'm after a Kingslayer who kidnapped Triss Marigold. And brought her here? Is this an interrogation? There are warrants on your head in Tamaria, Kedwin, and Redania. And I'm responsible for Saskia's safety. That's enough, Philippa. You told me yourself you thought him innocent. Saskia, folk are riled. First the sun went out, then the squirrels arrived. Now this fog. It's too much for the common folk. True. Summon all the commanders to the meeting hall. Yorveth, give me some time. I must prepare them for your arrival. Would Jesus! You, Philippa, you must be there too. I wish to hear what we can expect from this anomaly and how we might be rid of it. Worry not, Yarfin. The legendary White Wolf and the equally famous Philippa Eilhart should have a remedy for several hundred rabid wraiths. Wait, 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 several hundred rabid wraiths? What? I want to see all commanders in the council chamber. Philippa, that includes you and the Witcher. Cecil, the gates are to remain shut until we're done. You will answer with your beard if they open for any reason. Welcome to Vergen, Witcher. I have Cecil concerns. Thunder, the Girl <laughs> We've got a spare room at the inn. It's not much, but uh, at least you'll have a roof over your head and a solid bed neath your ass. Thanks. I could use that. Scalen. Yeah. Show Master Geralt aye, aye. quarters. And visit Reverend Alkin's chambers on your way back to inform everyone that uh, he has departed. That is, that he died a hero, slain by the invaders. Exactly. You see, Master Witcher? He's young but clever. We'll make a real dwarf out of him yet. This is awkward. But hey, I got out of that initial village where the dead bodies just hung there for days on end. Ah. <sighs> now I have been kidnapped and placed into here. Okay. <laughs> Where are we going, buddy? Take me this way? Oh, this is like a mining- Oh, okay. Very dapper. I like it. I like it. I like- I like this architecture. It's very nice. What the fuck? 
Oh, we got we got a punch fight over here, huh? Okay. Punch some people. Where where are we going, buddy? You're leading the way. A nice room. This shall be your chamber, Witcher. They say Selkirk of Gullet himself slept in this bed before battle. Whatever that is. Luck, but at least he was never arrested before he died. Oh Jesus. Need anything else? Oh my Thanks. god. The war council. Oh nice, I got my little thingy here. Since when did you decide to find it? Saskia treats the peasant as our equals. And once you let a dog inside, you never speak in the dog house. But that's not for me to judge. The point is, you can make good coin off this match. Any rules to this? Each contender puts down his stick up for the next fight. Yeah, let's do it. For starters, you'll stand up. In that case. Don't be afraid of him. Stop stroking him and wrap him up. On the boob. That was a sight for sore eyes. Beautiful but you're moving up the road. Sure, why not? Tender, please. The better the apart. In that case. Fight these balls. Slug it between the eyes. To the playlist, you're moving up the ranks, sir, just like you worthy. Excellent. This is the strongest hurry before it. In that case, let's do fifty. Stop stroking him and wrap him up. Show. Seems there's no one left to challenge. You couldn't be more wrong. So silly, right? It is I. Oh, this guy looks like a dick. You've always claimed such fights were a primitive diversion for commoners. A true knight duels another in the exquisite company of ladies and real gentlemen. Oh, I, I never forget the great achievements of Selkirk in the Cornets. On many occasions did my brother prove his greatness. Alas, the world's going to the Falcons. But there's a Witcher among you. And though his blood is no match for mine, his warring mastery is satisfaction. Perhaps when he drops to the ground at my feet, you'll realize I challenge you, Witcher. The wager is two sacks of gold. The le what the fuck? Sure. Stand and fight. Okay. Slug it between the eyes. Fight these balls. Don't be a 
afraid of him. You won. Finish me off. Oh. Besides, it was only a fist fight. I'd rather have died at your hands. It was an honest fight, just like you won. You failed to understand. My reputation is ruined. My honor gone. What do you expect? Not sure I care about your reputation. Pretty much. Sildrat forgets no insult. Congratulations to the victors and thanks to the vanquished. You proved your mastery, Witcher. Fighting you is an honor. Let's tend to the pool. Fight these balls. All right. Thought we had a basilisk in the basement. Turns out it was just my wife getting old. Oh Jesus Christ! Who's he? He travels the land. Oh, He's a monster. So point. Why has he got those glistening eyes? Sorcerers mutated him when he was young. Business or rest? Rest. And maybe some trading. Ah. Welcome. How can I help you? That's pretty much it. That's all I got. Escape. Let's take them all. Who the fuck cares? A harpy. Okay. Here's a pillager crap. Do some thumb notes. Shit, someone's inside. Okay. I actually really like this town. This is nice. Way better than that fucking mud pit that we were in. Whoa! What a bridge! Spook the burbs! Man, I'm going on a field trip here, okay. I am officially lost. Okay. I'm supposed to wait for events to unfold. Let's go do this. Beaver, 
thing to eh? be stored for That's that. a witcher, not Nothing a human. Good. So Would you look at that, friends? <laughs> Greetings. <laughs> you don't know me, but I know you. I'm an employee of the Vivaldus Bank, and I'm business here. To check up on the local mines, profit of the Vivaldus Bank. Okay. Full of beans. And as per the instructions given to each of the bank's agents, I hasten to inform you that you have unlimited credit. Hmm. He's alone about now. Sure thing. Um. However, my means are limited. I can offer you the standard short-term loan for those working in high-risk professions. Will that do you? Does that give me anything? I'm sure the Valdi wouldn't mind if I borrowed a bit more than that. It's nearly all I've got on me, but I'll manage somehow. All right. Always Wait. in a hurry. You'll have a short speed, Witcher. Yeah. Let's go back down. Oh my God! How do we go down? We can't just jump off. Fuck. Always so glum. Smile sometimes. Make us a knight. It says it's outside of here. Try anything. I can't escape. I can't escape. Oh no. Are you the me? Get over there. Hey, it's thick as corn stalks. It's just
Okay. He was quite a scrap gentleman, and an opportunity to slay a monarch. There was a struggle, and the prince was wounded. You've all seen the magical phenomenon covering the battlefield. Hi, Kira. For any who still have doubts, this is no mundane mist, nor a petty fairground illusion. Most likely, we're up against a blood curse. Blood an curse. Old and powerful spell. Spell. We do not know who cast it or why. Why not? For now, I have one piece of good news they didn't and leave several a memo? pieces of bad news. The good news is that Hensort and his army have been halted for the time being. And the bad news? The mist will grow. It may even engulf Bergen. Furthermore, wraiths may emerge from it. Yeah. And they be made penitent with an axe to the head. In theory, yes. But I would suggest putting your faith in a silver weapon. Furthermore, the ghosts will weaken as they move away from the mist. Is there any way to drive it off? Exorcise it? A question for myself and Geralt of Rivia. The Kingslayer? Contrary to what old women at the wells say, he did not, in fact, slay any kings. Of course he didn't. Wouldn't hurt a fly, that one. Look at his eyes. You'll see he's the sensitive kind. It's the sensitive kind. you may kind. see in his eyes, few you know more about lifting curses. Gentlemen, I do not require you to understand this phenomenon, but there are a few rules I insist you must follow. Here we go. The fuck, Zoltan? No is to approach the mist. It is mortally dangerous. Okay. In addition, we need to learn the story of the battle. Okay. For this, I especially count on the aid of Mr. Cecil Burden. Okay. At your service, my lady. Thank you. To lift the curse, we require some objects symbolic of the war. Ones belonging to those who perished here three years past. <laughs> More scrap iron from that massacre lying about than light and Cecil's beard. I thought curses were best handled with... Please leave the thinking to me, Mr. Zigrin. And I'd gladly hear less from you from now on. The objects must be magically active and strictly linked to the ghosts of the fallen. That is all. Let me be clear. You're all to aid Philippa and the Witcher. What are you grumbling about now, Yarpen? Uh, <clears throat> just something in my gullet. Take a swig of wine. Now, to worldly matters. How many are we? Saskia, you know well... How many? We dwarves are near 200. But don't judge us by our number. A half thousand peasants will come, though you'll get no precise count. My okay. lords. Fifty-three knights and another two hundred armed men. Not enough. Henselt leads five thousand. Five to one against us. What think you of that? We are few, they are many. But we have our walls, low though they be. If we had archers, who knows? You do have archers. A regiment of heavy arbalists from Lyria. We have something better. Yorvith's elves. Scoyatel. Yeah! Ah, <laughs> What kind of walking present? Gentlemen, I give you Yorvith. What Jesus. do you seek here, murderer? A oh hundred of the North's best archers await your orders, Dragon Slayer. You wished for archers? Here they are. I take no pleasure in fraternizing with elves, but even a shit coated stick can be a weapon. He burned down the villages of many in my horde. The free peasantry is one thing, but a criminal with a price on his head in all the northern realms? This is too much. Saskia, say the word and we'll depart. Hear me out. Yorvath came to fight for me. I trust him and I know that he'll stay the course. Just like each of you. How could you know that? He's an elf. Treason runs in his veins. Okay, that's just he fucking straight up rude. For a century. But for the first time in scores of years, his fight makes sense. Yeah. The Scoyatel know no peace. They've died for Nilfgaard, for the Valley of the Flowers, in vain. They've been betrayed and cheated. Now they have a new goal. The Clontar Valley could be the first state where no man would have to fear elven arrows when venturing beyond city walls. And elves and dwarves wouldn't live in ghettos or on reservations. First, however, we have a battle to win. You know who we're up against. It's a splendid army, brave and well-led. 
They cannot be scared off or routed. They have to be killed. I want Yorvath to sit at the same table as we do. I want him to kill Kadweni for us. And I assure you that he'll do so with a smile, if only you let him. If I'm to see a smile on that skinny face, <laughs> I'm in. Yorvath stays. Bloody hell. Father's turning in his grave, but a must's a must. I say I. I. Nay, you killed my men, Elf. Remember them? If I hadn't killed them, they'd have killed me. All right. For the sake of better times, and for Kedwin's doom, I down with the sons of bitches. Cheers. Okay. Uh-oh. What the shit? Poison! She's dying. Take her somewhere safe and guard her with your lives. I'll gather what I need and join you soon. I'll place my best warriors on watch. Quickly, lads! A letter! The shit! Ceased casting spells. She dead? Is she alive? In a manner of speaking, I've slowed her life functions as far as possible. Her condition is stable. What's the poison? Do you know the poison? Thormador, commonly known as Mage Pain. It has a terrible reputation. An antidote must exist. What can we do? Treatment will require herbs, magic, and blood. Not ordinary blood, I presume. Correct. We require royal blood. We could use Letho right now. <laughs> Why didn't it blood? On the other side of the mist of wraiths. You misunderstood me. It need not be the blood of a ruling lord. It is the genotype contained in royal blood that is required. Kings oh. issue from ancient dynasties. Over the ages, to survive, rulers needed exceptional resistance and strength. As royal dynasties rarely admit common blood, the strength of their genes remains great. I should okay. employ self-healing genetic therapy that will teach Saskia's body how to rid itself of the poison. You'll have her drink human blood. No, I shall inject it directly into her heart. Whoa! Okay, that's a bit... Mm, so, okay. What kind of herbs are we talking about? I'll need a subterranean variety of purple foxglove, known to the dwarves as the Immortel, and an elven rose of remembrance. Hmm. Triss had a rose of remembrance. She claimed the flowers are exceptional. Long ago, the Enshe, who succeeded in cultivating the roses, enjoyed great respect. Times have changed. As have elves. There are no elven gardens nearby. We must return to Flotsam. Triss has a Rose of Remembrance from Flotsam. It's her we need to find. Okay. Where will we find Immortel? They grow deep beneath the earth, which should not be a problem as Vergen lies on top of a mine. How will they help Saskia? Mage pain wreaks havoc in internal tissues. The Immortel will help restore them. What else, else do you need? Saskia? Thormador is a self-perpetuating substance. Any incursion into a cluster of poisoned cells causes an immediate chain reaction. Each tainted cell that is removed is replaced by ten new tainted cells. Jesus. To interrupt this reaction, I'll need an ungodly amount of the power. A water or air genie, or one of the twenty legendary rings of power would be best. One to bring them all and in the darkness bind them. Right. And then I'll have to run barefooted to the top of a volcano. All right, all right. Let's forget the rings. I need a vast quantity of the power, no matter the source. Find something. To take in the harvest eyes and guard. Remembrance, royal blood and magic. Oh. A poor one at that. No prince's kiss to top things off. I wish it were a fairy tale, especially a poor one, as a happy ending would then be inevitable. 
Anything I can from your help, Geralt. I mean, we don't really have a choice. I must first see if the spells keeping Saskia alive are in order. Then we'll consider how best to send the spectres to their rest. Actually, you could tend to that yourself. Ask the locals about the battle, and maybe you'll learn something. In that case, I shall search for the poisoner. Only Philippa Isleheart may enter. This is a maze in here. All of these things are fucking outside of the fucking... Oh, what did I pick up? Maybe it's just a sleeve. Then I heard a squirrel and says gravely. Who fed the bird? There's some merchants up here. I saw some stuff. Clucky be cluck cluck. Cluckers. like any other nothing special about them ah you're mistaken few know how to make a silver blade today fish eat me if i'm lying and engraving runes is not exactly farting down a rain spout farting down a rain spout care to browse through my wares sure Can you craft? I have that. What's your superb silver sword? Seventeen to twenty five. 
Leading is tough for service. It's a robust long sword that needs to get replaced. Is that a silver or is that I wouldn't like it? That's a silver sword, yeah no. Got some more of those. I need to go find storage place. People of Dergan, we have a magical mist full of ghosts just outside our walls. So you'd better think twice before entering it. The mist, may the plague take it. Threatens all manner of creatures. So anyone headed to the quarries or walking through the galleys should take exceptional heed. The squirrels that have made camp by the burnt huts are not our enemies. So says Saskia. So it is. Master Geralt of Rivia and Sorceress Philippa Eilhart will deal with the mist and the wraiths. And now, open the gates and get to work. Alright. I must talk to you, Witcher. As you scratch your junk in front of me, okay? What's going on? I'm Elias, of Jorvet's commando. I have an urgent matter. Tell me. Men from Bergen have been disappearing for some time. We recently found some of their corpses, so it doesn't seem to be desertion. Okay. Where did you find the bodies? Uh -oh. In different places, mainly in the burned village near the ravine that leads to the town. I need to see the corpses. They're all buried. Where? Beneath a mound in the forest behind Bergen. But you shouldn't go there. Why not? Desecrating graves is a serious offense. The families of the dead will be furious. What state were the bodies in? They looked gruesome. Nothing an elf would have done, nor a human. Okay. Only men among the victims? Young men. Humans and elves. I don't work for free. You'll get your reward. Do well, and I may give you something more than coin. Oh? We're losing good men. Oh. Okay. Hmm. I'll see what I can do. First things first, I need to jump off a bunch of stuff. Let me tell you about the fell from the sky. One freak bigger than the next. Come on! Don't be afraid of him! Geralt, sit down. We haven't yet celebrated your... Ah, sorry, sorry. Where am I? Sheldon Skaggs? Veteran of the battles of Sodden and Brenna? And all lands along the way. You've already met Vergen's elder? Greetings. Gentlemen. Not sure about you, but my throat's parched from all these greetings. Funny, those were the first words out of your mouth. Master Dandelion's right. <laughs> Around for everyone. On me. I'd gladly drink, but Saskia, would... how can we help? Speak. Have you ever heard of a plant called the Dwarven Immortel? Have we? Depends off tight arses. To tell the truth, I've no idea, Sky. Just a saying. You're the only one using it. Oh! Witcher, the immortal. <laughs> it appears most often near anthracite and aluminosilicate deposits. Philippa needs it to heal Saskia. A rare curio. But there's a mine nearby, and who knows? You might find it deep underground. Why don't you one of you fuckers come with me? Why are you dwarves? The fuck? Saskia? If I had a knack for business. I'd be sitting on my arse in my own inn, not giving a shit for this war. And what's my trade? Axe swinging. That's what. And if I could get killed, I'd rather know what I'm risking my neck for. The woman's cuckoo. Ready to spit in the Emperor's face, even. But I have to admit, 
She knows all that war crap. And damn it, she's right. Free Bergen. No matter if you're a dwarf, man, or mangy elf. Do you hear him, Zigrin? Down in the elves already. But I bet he wouldn't sniff at 30 additional archers in battle. Is the mine far? Not at all. It's in Bergen itself, in the town's upper quarter. You're eager for this expedition, but uh, nobody told the Witcher that the mine was closed. Closed? That's true. But it's long overdue a cleaning. Weed out all the underground shit. Uh, what are you talking about? Not a month ago, miners started disappearing. Must have tapped the wrong vein and woken some scum from the deep. We wanted to send a crew of stout fellows in, but Saskia said she needs all the soldiers she can find up top and ready to defend the town. We closed the shaft, fearing the filth would emerge and overrun us all. Looks like we arrived some time. Hey, get up. So it seems. Let's go. Right on. With this crew, we needn't fear any monster. How about you, Sheldon? You coming with us, or stay around to get your fuck? Another chance that this won't come around in a hurry. Fucking can wait. I'm with you. Yes! Oh, where's Esteban? He loves dwarves. This is the... This is the... This is the party, man. This guy's like already going, and I'm like, I still need to go to. I still need to go to my room and deposit shit. Oh my god, hold on, buddies. I mean, I'm not really into the those things right now, so. Alright, those don't hurt that much. Okay. You guys all like crafting stuff, and right now I'm not really looking to be crafting. I am looking to go kick some ass. Let's go. Let's go for some ass kicking. Another one. You let one human in and hold that story a thousand times. I've heard enough of flying women. Hang to the left, take a right, take a right. Hang to the left. Take a right. Take a right. There they are. There they are. The Witcher's on board. Let's get to work, my dear. Open the shaft, Skaggs. If Here you we kill go. all those monsters, the whole of Vergen will be grateful. I'm sure some coin will be found. We'll keep that in mind, sir. So, Sheldon. You opened the shaft yet? Keep your pricks in your trousers. You can't just plow forward all the time. A mind is like a lover. You need to be gentle so she accepts you more. And more. You and your music, Sheldon. You don't say. <laughs> It's safe because we're gonna go do some bullshittery. 
Let's go. One, two, three. Oh my god, I hope to god they don't die. True dwarfs get three things to do in life. Build a fortress, cut down an oak, and plough regularly. I think I heard something. Oh. What the fuck was that? This may appear you must have a nest nearby. Come on, show yourselves. I'll let you taste my axe. Oh, you're making them shit bricks. Even then, it stick less than you. Oh, my God, you wet your wet recently, Witcher. Okay, well, we're gonna start with this side. Silver sword. That's unfortunate. I was gonna put the cat's paw, whatever the fuck. Right, that should do it. Fuck! Shit! 
Again, kitty? Alright, thanks for the, the cheers. Holy shit, I just blew that up. Okay. Alright, meditate. I need to put... I need to put this on. I can't fucking see shit. No. Oh. Oh, so happy Valentine's again, yeah. I'm hoping everybody had a good day. There we go, now I can see things. Since we're going on this path. Guess we don't collapse the tunnel in here. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh, we just talk. I want to loot the body. Oh, come on. There we go. Like my potion is, is, is drying up, man. These guys are in the way. You required, okay.
to arms. Legs, the torso, ta la 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 la, right? are in my way. That's okay. Start all over next week on that. So, all right, boys and girls, and everything that's in between. That is it for me this evening. I got through the the Lado, Laredo, Jethro. I don't know what the hell's name was. I got through that fight. Um. So yeah, I am going to stop the stream. I know that we've got some Power World stuff to do post-stream. I know that I've got some other things to do, but, 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 I actually managed to get something done. I actually posted a guide today. I'm actually really happy. I finally got it done. There it is. So, got that done. I've already posted it. Um... It's not a video one, obviously. So, yeah. Um, that's like my biggest achievement for the day. <laughs> that was actually supposed to be done on Saturday, but I was dragging my feet. I was dragging my feet so hard. Because I'm just like, I'm tired of this map. Ugh. I think it's because I end up doing a lot of those meta maps for the longest time to farm for other things. And then when I get around to making a guide for it, I'm just like, oh my god. It's good though. I mean, it's it feel I feel good. I feel accomplished. So I did that. Um, tomorrow is Warframe, and yeah. So that's about it. We've got the Armor Three back up. Um, I think Vic probably started it. I think he said he was playing it. Um, I'm going to hop on to that real quick before I start up Power World. If Vic is still running it. So I can get my loadout started. I need to purge all of those other loadouts. and start fresh. And then we can start up the armor thing. Not tonight. Well, whatever. You know what I mean. We will always ping that stuff. So yeah, that is all that we've got going on. Also, remember, for those of you who are in the D&D sessions, we are doing our test drive this Saturday for Vampire the Masquerade. Um, I've only had three people tell me names and passwords. So that we can, you know, allow you access to the foundry. So, if you haven't done that yet, time's ticking. Power rolls should be up and running again. I'm not quite sure how to ask Vic, but yeah. Um, but yeah. Just got stuff going on. Always something to do in this Discord, in this community, which is nice. So, it's fun. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Until then, take care, stay safe. Stay warm if you are in some frigid temperature to the climates or whatevs. Or stay cool if you're in a hot climate. I don't know. Either way, stay comfortable. Catch you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.
That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over.